frequency. Surrounded by magnetic waves day in and day out, what are the health concerns? Also, technology. It's all around us. How it affects our health at 9.30. Staying with us, I'm Ron Zapola. And I'm Libby Weaver. Well, you'd be surprised at what you're exposed to when at home, work, even while driving your car. New at 9.30 tonight, Fox 31 Shaw Turner takes a look at electromagnetic frequencies and how they could be affecting us. Shaw? Microwaves, blow dryers, even alarm clocks. Many researchers say they emit frequencies that can cause health problems. But experts say we can coexist with the technology we depend on. We live in a world where we're bombarded by these man-made man -made frequencies. Dr. Robert Blake says our bodies can be knocked out of balance by an overload of electromagnetic frequencies, or EMFs. Studies that do exist and early on um, show how EMFs can disrupt uh, the function of cells. He says many illnesses can result. Upset stomach or stomach pain or heartburn. Um, certainly someone who's in front of a computer all the time that that EMF exposure can affect points on the chest. This is something called a tri-field meter. It measures the amount of EMFs. And actually, as your camera comes close to it, look at that. <laughs> it shows a normal copier emits a high amount, even a foot away from the machine. It's how much that we're getting exposed to just in the course of using the copier. A laptop registers high as well. That's just sitting on where your fingers go, uh, and that's basically pegs. Cell phones and even small radios set off the meter. Dr. Blake says you can wear devices that can help protect you from EMFs. This is called a Q-Link. It's set at a natural frequency. Oh, Taekwondo instructor Darren Carr spends hours under fluorescent lights and on his cell phone. He says using a Q-Link improved his ability level. I just felt like all the time I had a, uh, a higher level of uh, energy. But doctors also say a surefire way to reduce EMF exposure is to keep several feet away from high frequency objects whenever you can. And of course we know that's not always convenient. Well it is possible to test for your exposure to electromagnetic fields. For information about that and the Q-Link we just showed you, go to our website at fox31news.com. Just click on viewer information. Cell phones, computers, all the blow dryer. I mean, it affects yeah, just about it's all everything. of everything. Yeah, yeah. Even the circuitry in your car because it's all computerized. Thanks for the good news, Sean. Yeah, have a nice drive home, Bob. <laughs> Turn everything off. <laughs> okay. So